How to remove something from an image, super simple these days. Uh, let's use an image I took, or a photo I took a couple weeks ago of my two nieces. Um, I'm just gonna right click, edit in Photoshop. Now I'm in Lightroom here. You can just open your image in Photoshop and be just the same. I just use Lightroom because I do a lot of um, photography stuff, so. All right, so for an example, what we want to do, let's zoom in just a little bit here. I have two things I want to adjust here. We got this little rock I want to remove. I don't really need to, but that's more for an example. And then let's remove this little tag that's right here that I forgot to take off before we gave her the flowers. So let's start with the rock. This is an easy one. Uh, there's a few different ways to do this. The easiest way I found for most applications is this. I use the lasso tool. I just draw a circle around. You don't have to be accurate. You don't have to be right up against the rock. Um, and then as long as we are on the background layer, um, all we gotta do is hit the delete key on Mac and hit okay. We're using content aware. What that means is it's gonna use all the surrounding pixels to build our image when it removes it. Now to deselect, because you had to deselect before you do anything else, it's Command D. And let's go ahead and move back up here. And we're gonna do the same thing. I still have my lasso tool. I'm still on the background layer. Okay, so let's go ahead and draw our little thing around this. And we'll see what kind of a job it does here. And I'm using a mouse, so bear with me. Let's hit delete, enter. There you go. Is it perfect? Probably not. But after we deselect and zoom back out to the, to the photo there, you really can't tell. It looks a lot better though. So it's pretty easy. That's just one way to do it. And I think if you're not on the background, I think you can hit shift delete and it would do the same thing. Or I think you can come up here and do fill. Uh, hopefully that helps you out.